Hey there guys, I'm Cody Mayo, and this is Cigar TV, and on today's episode of Cigar TV, uh, we are doing a cigar re gadget review. Uh, there's many types of cigar gadgets that you utilize in your cigar smoking uh, career, I guess you could say, or not career, just time to time hobby for some people. Anyways, you got your cutters, uh, an essential tool for obviously cutting the cigar uh, cap off and being able to smoke the cigar itself. And of course, you got your lighters, which you can use matches as well to light your cigar. Lighter is going to be a little bit faster, but that depends on the type of uh, uh I guess you could say uh, the type of way you like to light your cigars, whether you're more of a naturalist and like to light it with a match or a piece of cedar, or if you want to just get it started and you don't care about all that, then you'd go with the lighter. Alright, so, there's also a cigar, uh, you can get like cigar stands and stuff like that, but I don't really have one available right now to like show but you can get cigar holders or stands so you can set your cigars down on them uh, or you could just use an ashtray which has the holder already uh, made into the uh, structure of the ashtray itself now today's gadget will actually be something that you'd use to uh, use to help tune up the lighter with I'm talking about this right here. This is a cigar lighter uh, tune-up tool. It's made by Zycar. I got the packaging right here. Uh, it's about $15, give or take. <clears throat> so, what you're able to do with this uh, cutter right here is not only can you use this screwdriver Phillips head right here to help uh, take apart the lighter, put it back together, whatever you need to do to help tune it up. But if you have a flat head on that lighter, this bit actually comes out and it has a secondary flat head uh, part on it as well. So it's a reverse, reversible uh, screwdriver tip. On the bottom here, you got this uh, cap right here that covers up this uh, kind of like it's like a pipe kind of, and it flows through the tool here, and there's this hole that attaches to this pipe right here. That allows you to be able to bleed your lighter, and this hole right here acts like a whistle. Now. Whenever you're bleeding the lighter, the thing that you're trying to do is get the trapped air in the lighter to come out of the lighter so you can always get a perfect uh, ignition on the lighter itself. And pretty much, you just take the uh, your lighter, if it's refillable, you can use this part right here to just find where you uh, put in the lighter fluid and you press down on it like this. I don't know if you can hear that or not, but that sound right there is trapped air st stuck in the uh, lighter itself. Now once you stop hearing the sound coming through here, because if you use like a, uh, say like a pen or something to like push that down, sometimes it gets hard to hear the uh, trapped air coming out of the uh, lighter. This will make it 10 times easier because it's kind of acting like a whistle, kind of, not much of a whistle, but a whistle nonetheless. But yeah, this is a very useful tool. And of course, you can put this cap back on and just stand it up. Somewhat like that, you know. Nothing too special, but I think it's a pretty cool looking, a pretty, it is a cool looking tool. But also, it's a really useful tool itself. Um, I believe you can get these off 
just about any retailer. I got this from uh, Cigar International, uh, straight from uh, their one of their stores. Uh, there's a couple of stores here in Texas, and then of course their original store in Pennsylvania. But yeah, uh, that's all I really have for this video. Uh, great gadget to have for your lighters and stuff and to uh, tune them up and all that so yes uh, if you like what you saw in this video and would like to see more videos like this one uh, hit that subscribe button and hit that thumbs up if you like the video and if you would like to follow me on my other uh, social media uh, platform uh, my Instagram is cigar TV 91 uh, that's I post sometimes regularly over there sometimes not it just really depends uh, you can see what I get up to in my day-to-day -day, uh, personal life and then so yeah till next time guys stay safe out there and stay smoky.